Hey guys, Top Flames here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Aether mod. I did this mod a while ago and showed you how to install it, but they've updated it now, so I'm going to show you how to do it again. Uh, so first you're going to want to go to Minecraft forums and go to the mod and download the things that you'll need. So if you, there's going to be a link in the description to get to it, and then you scroll down and you'll get to this part. <coughs> Uh, download where it says click to download, download that, that's the other mod, and then download mod loader, mod loader, MP, audio mod, player API, and shock API. Uh, those things I'll show you how to install, but just download them and yeah. So once you have all them downloaded, uh, you're going to want to unzip them. And as you can see, I did that already. And then you're going to want to open up your Minecraft folder. So to do that, you go to your username, library, application support, and then you go Minecraft. And then from in there, you're going to click on ban. And now there's this Minecraft.jar folder, or .jar. You're going to want to open it with Archive Utility. and then you're going to want to delete it. Now rename that folder it just made to minecraft.jar and add and now you're going to open it. Now before you start anything what you want to do is going to, you're going to want to search for meta and in the minecraft.jar and see this folder meta imp you're going to want to delete it. Now you're going to want to go back and go back to where you have all your downloads and for, you're going to want to open the mod loader form. Wait for that. Oh, there we go. And you're going to want to drag and drop all of the mod loader ones into Minecraft.jar and you're going to replace all of them if it asks you to replace any. Now I'm going to open Minecraft, make sure it's still working. This is a good idea, so then if you mess up, you know which part you mess up on. So it's still working. So now you're going to want to go back, and the next one I'm going to install is uh, the Shock API. It says SAPI R11 as of right now, but it'll say SAPI on it. Uh, now you're going to drag and drop all the files. You go, so I guess I forgot this step, but you'll open that folder and there'll be source and bin. Don't click on source, that's for modders. Just go to bin and then copy it all and then paste. Or drag and drop. And check and make sure Minecraft's still working. While that's loading, I'm going to open up the next folder to get it ready. And you're going to want to go and don't take the text files when you do the next one. And the next one I'm doing is MC uh, Player API Client. You don't need the... Uh, oh, I messed that up. So I just, I just remember this, but when you install that last one, you will get an error. And it's going to be looking for the Player API Client's DI class, which is right here. Which is the next one that we're installing. So just drag and drop that in and replace and now check and see if it's working it should work this time yeah see it works now i'm going to do mod loader mp so just drag and drop all the files and replace and check make sure Minecraft's working again. And I'm gonna open up the mod, audio mod folder over here. And just wait. Okay, so it worked. So now you're gonna just get the first class and IBXM and you're gonna drag and drop those in. Don't 
drag and drop false code in. You're going to want to go into Minecraft.jar, which is where you're putting all the, where you should have open still. You're going to want to find false code. So, and click jar, and it's right there. Now you're going to want to click sound and codex. Now go back to audio mod folder and do the same. And then drag and drop this codec file into the codec file in the Minecraft.jar. And then go back out to the Minecraft.jar. Now we're going to do the final check and then we're going to install the other mod. So if you, when you open up the other mod folder, there's going to be jar and resources. And the one you're going to open up first is jar. So open up jar. And there's going to be a lot of files. Slow there. Okay, there we go. Wait for it to finish loading. There we go. Computer's being slow. Oh, that's forced. Do it this way. Okay, so. You can go edit and then select all, and then I'll select all the things in that jar file that's in the either mod folder. So then you're gonna drag and drop them into the Minecraft.jar folder and replace all the ones that need replacing. So once that's done. Then you're gonna wanna go back to your Minecraft folder, which you go username, library, application support, and then Minecraft, or you just hit the back button. And then you wanna click on resources and mod. Actually, don't click on mod, just stay in there. And then you wanna go hit back, and then go resources, and then copy this mod folder that's in the resources folder of the other mod folder. and paste it in. And replace. So now that that's done, you can X off all those and open Minecraft. Log in. And then you should have this. Um, they have edited the client, so they have their own thing on it. And if you go and make a new world, I'll just make a uh, creative one here so I can show you that it works. And first time loading up the load we might take a little while. Mine went pretty fast. I'm gonna have light here for a second. There we go. It's still kinda lagging. Oh well. Anyways, so so I get to the other, um, you have to build a portal, and I'll show you how to do that right now. So you need lightstone, which is right there, 
or glowstone, sorry. And a bucket of water. So it's just like going to the nether, but... And now you're in the other. Whoa, I just jumped off a cliff. And sometimes you'll spawn in like weird spots and there will be nothing around you. But yeah. So here I'll try and find some land to show you. Here we are. There are clouds, but it'll work, sort of. Yeah, so this is the other. Normally there's more land. I don't know why I don't have very much land right now. Let's try and find some. There we go. So yeah, really it's another Minecraft inside of Minecraft that you can explore and there's uh, bosses and lots of new items. I'll show you some of the items quickly. Um, There's other dirt, grass, weak soil, holy stone. Uh, I'm not gonna read them off. I'll just kind of scroll over them. Uh, there's the trees. Lots of uh, new materials as well, like uh, pickaxes and things. Scroll down. Here. You have darts, bows and arrows. You can make. Uh, Lots of things. There's capes and stuff too. I'm being hit by snowballs, which is one of the uh, mobs. I can try and find him. There is he. Oh, there he is. There's one of the mobs. There's lots of mobs. They add in. They just added Christmas presents, so. Yeah, so this is the other mod. Uh, there's another mob that's a whale type thing. But yeah, if you need any help uh, installing it, uh, just leave a comment and please like and subscribe.